because she's been notified of a uh, horse is giving birth on top of a mountain and the horse is um, abandoned the baby is that what's going on the foal would not stand up and the mother abandoned it so we got some uh, corn syrup and we're going to take it up there and try to get the, the baby to, to drink some of it and while we have a horse rescue place coming. Get off the gate, walk around the big area. They just set it down here under a tree. So technically, we're trespassing, trying to rescue this horse. Uh, you know, but got to do what you got to do, I guess. Basically what goes on, uh, people have brought a bunch of horses up on the top of this mountain top and abandoned them pretty much. And uh, so nobody takes care of them. And now this horse is in need. That, okay, it's a beautiful animal. I say it is. My back wouldn't hurt, I'd carry it for you. We gotta get you some food. The community's coming together to help. The people have stopped when they saw us pick him up and they've, they've agreed to help her carry it because she just she couldn't carry it anymore and I can't pick it up at all. So. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Just trying to get a horse to stand up and get him some help. Back the truck. He's so pretty. That's a curve from West Virginia roads. <laughs> So it was 86 degrees out today. Uh, his mother gave birth to him and he's been out there five hours. Mother left him and wasn't coming back. He couldn't stand. And if a horse doesn't stand, the mother will reject it and walk away. He wasn't going to survive. Uh, and the mother was nowhere to be found. Uh, nowhere around. We searched around, couldn't find mommy. Uh, so we got this little guy, all thanks to this lady right here who was yes. a heart bigger than. I've ever met. You can't leave a baby. And I gotta admit, he's the prettiest horse I've ever seen. Never. I think he's, my shoulder is like mommy or something. <laughs> So we knew that time was very important at this point. He'd already been left alone. He'd been left by his mom for five hours in the heat. He had to be dehydrated. Uh, so instead of waiting for the rescue, we took him on to Tractor Supply, bought him some colostrum, uh, a, a bottle. We mixed it up on the counter at Tractor Supply as we were paying for it to get it out there. And one of the employees uh, helped us uh, get things going so we could get him some food in his belly as, as quick as we can because time we knew is is not his friend right now and that if he's going to make it every second is important.
to Bella Run Equine Rescue who specializes in foals and they will try and rehab them there. And you're with who? Part of Phoenix Equine Rescue. Good cause. You guys have come out and taken care of this foal for us. And... We got, uh, Any kind of help you could give them. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Bye, buddy. What the heck are y'all doing to me? Yeah, he rode. There you go.